This is the Athena cantaloupe that we, we shipped to King Supers. This is a variety that we grow strictly here for the fruit stand. Sixth generation Rocky Ford cantaloupe grower Brian Knapp showing off both types of this year's crop. Thicker flesh and a uh, little bit higher, higher in sugar. We love the flavor on it. This cantaloupe here holds up extremely well good shelf life. Rocky Ford taking pride in its world famous cantaloupes. First thing is the cantaloupes are not bad. The cantaloupes are excellent. The quality of the cantaloupes are, are extremely good. All over town, cantaloupes are the draw to roadside produce stands. Even though the growing and harvest season left with a 90 degree heat of summer. Basically the season is over. We have not shipped cantaloupes into the Denver area for close to three weeks now. Now deep into September, a death and several illnesses across a handful of states are being linked to listeria, which state health investigators say are linked to bacteria on the outside of the famous Rocky Ford cantaloupes. There's been a statewide outbreak of listeria and the epidemiologists have strong evidence to believe that this outbreak is linked to cantaloupe from the Rocky Ford region. Well, there are still plenty of cantaloupes for sale, even though the season is pretty much over, albeit with a common sense warning. Be very hygienic. Wash your fruits and vegetables very well. If you're not in that high risk group, you should be fine. At Knapp's and other produce stands, there are crates of cantaloupes left for sale, and folks are buying and getting the warning as well. As a precaution, you just need to wash. I love them. They've got a wonderful taste, so. And I just love to stop here and get my cantaloupe and watermelon. This while area markets are taking the items off shelves, even though farmers say there's little evidence the famous Rocky Ford treats are bad. I don't think it's uh, the cantaloupe's fault, it's handling. The Arkansas Valley has not had one single case of listeria, and, and we have all kinds of people, elderly, children, eating cantaloupes every day, every day. And, they just love them, you know, They're, the, the scare is not bothering the local people. While state health is advising against eating Rocky Ford cantaloupes, growers say they think the problems are being caused in the processing or distribution stage. But here at one of the bigger processing plants, the word is no comment. Best advice, follow the advisory just to be safe. In Rocky Ford, John Bowman, Fox 31 Denver.